You can ring in the new year with these sexy, glamorous eyes. Pair this amazing look with a cute black dress and you're ready to celebrate the new year. We're going to skip foundation and use eyeshadow primer. I'm using Lancome's Ombre Perfector. This will not only keep the eyeshadow lasting longer, but help saturate the eyeshadow colors. Using Milani Runway Eyeshadow, you can buy this at most drugstore, load your brush with shimmering white color, and apply it along the innermost corner of your eyes. It's usually easier to work from light to dark. Don't forget the brow bone. Using the champagne eyeshadow, apply the color along the hollows of your eyes. Use a window wiper motion. We're creating shadows around your crease area. Select the burgundy color and apply it along the outer V. We're setting in the undertone for the glitter. Blend the color out. Using the black eyeshadow, darken the outer V more. We're building the intensity for the eyes. Blend the colors and taper out the ends. Using silver cosmetic grade glitter and using clear lip gloss as adhesive, apply it right on the center of the lids. Try using lip gloss that doesn't have any harsh chemicals or lip plumping ingredients. Now with your fingers, apply glitter on the center of your lids. You can use a brush, or in my case, fingers. Gently pat the area, don't drag the glitter, just pat it on. Now using a clean finger, blend the glitter out just a bit. It shouldn't have a hard edge. Using purple glitter, I'm using Milani Glitter Gel. Apply it on your lids. This part is optional. If you want more glitter, use pink or fuchsia glitter. Dab it around the silver and on top of the purple gel. Keep the glitter within the center of the lids. Make sure the texture is even. Remember to use cosmetic grade. Any other glitter that isn't cosmetic grade will scratch up your skin and can ruin your eyes. Using L'Oreal's Hip Black Cream Eyeliner, apply this above the pink glitter. Blend out the cream and taper out the ends. Create a cat eye effect. Using scotch tape, Tape the back of your hand first to remove excess glue and pat the tape along any areas with excess glitter. This is an easier way to remove your glitter. Now the eyes are almost finished. But let's move on to foundation and concealer because we've already used the glitter and tape. We can safely apply the foundation and concealer on the face. If we had foundation on before we applied the glitter, the tape would have removed parts of the foundation, ruining the perfected texture we created. Take loose powder and apply it along your under eye circles to set the concealer. 
using Lancome's translucent powder and Laura Mercier's powder puff, blot off the excess and mattify your entire face. Don't worry if it's uneven, we can brush it off later. Just focus on mattifying your face. Using Iku's powder brush, brush off the excess. Redefine your brows. I recommend going for a medium look. Not too full, but not too skinny. Remember, keep both eyebrows even. Using clear eyebrow gel, brush the brows in place to keep all the hairs in line. Apply eyeliner using NYC eyeliner. Line half of your lower lash line. and close your eyes real tight. This will transfer the eyeliner to the top of your upper waterline. Now apply purple eyeliner. This will balance the look out. Apply the silver glitter along the inner corners of your eyes. This will make your eyes appear wet. Now line your lash line. Use small strokes and connect. Create cat eyes for that sexy look. Using Ardell Demi Lashes, apply a thin strip of glue on the lashes and wait 20 seconds for it to become tacky. And apply it right along the outer corners of your eyes. Try not to use full false lashes because it can overwhelm the beautiful effect of the glitter. Curl your lashes. I'm using Shu Uimura's Lash Curler. And apply mascara. This is L'Oreal's Telescopic Lash Explosion Mascara. Apply the mascara on the lashes and fake lashes to bind your real lashes with the fake ones. Don't forget the lower lash line. Apply blush using Bobbi Brown's Cream Blush. Make sure it's matte using Lancome's Highlighter Brush. Apply it right along the upper cheekbones. Remember to keep your entire face matte because the glitter is so intense. Anything else that shines on your face will underwhelm the effect of the glitter. A matte face and lips will balance out the intensity of the glitter. Using any soft pink blush of your choice, apply it over the cream blush to set the color. This will help the blush show up in photographs. Using Maybelline's Sensational Lip Color in Pink Please, apply the lipstick evenly. 
the soft pink nude lips would bring more attention to the eyes. Love is not a trend It's what we want to Call it old fashion, call it fame this part is optional, glittering mascara, using Lancome's Oscillation Silver Glitter Mascara. Apply the Silver Glitter Mascara on the lashes. This will make the eyes sparkle more and will look so beautiful in pictures. Now you're finished. Time to rock out this fun look and ring in the new year. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Have a wonderful new year.